All right, I'm looking at another fibble today. This is like Wordle, except on each row, one of the clues is a lie or a fib. Um, and we're starting with the word stock. So, uh, I mean, I usually like to repeat some letters to try and get uh, some contradictions. Stall seems like a good follow-up. Okay, so, right, so one of the two S's is a lie, one of the two L's is a lie, which means, oop, everything else is true. Now, let's think about this for just a quick second, though. Is it possible Yes, it is possible that this one is the lie. If this yellow is true, and there's supposed to be a green at the end, this would be the lie then. So one of the two L's is a lie. We don't know which one, but we know the T and the A are true. Um, there is either an S or an L in the word, but not both. Mm, no, no, that's not true. <laughs> we know this S is not supposed to be green. We know that. Because uh, that would make both of these lies and then those are all have to be true. But we could have, if this is, uh, if this is true, uh, actually, let's see, is it possible, if this was the lie, no, if this one's true, and this is the lie, then this is the lie, and that one's true. Yeah, so we can't have both an S and an L in the word. There's an S or an L in the word. That is true. Okay, and we need to get a new spot for the a, I'd like to try an L at the end to see what I get. Um, uh, let's see. What about, ooh, I, was, I said I want to try an L at the end, but we could do aisle. That's not bad. We could still look for a contradiction with the L. Okay, so we know there is an A in the word, but this could still be the lie if it's supposed to be, oh, oh, let's look at the L first. Okay, the, the, the A could be a lie if it's supposed to be green. This is, Okay, so clearly it can't be yellow and green. It also can't be gray and green. So two of those three are lies. Two of those three are lies. Now, knowing that two of the three are lies, right? No, not this. Uh, no. No, this could be a lie. These could both be true if it's a green at the end. Oh. Yeah. That's possible. Shoot. Unfortunately. But, but, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because the point still works. The point that I made in my head that I haven't said yet because I need to get it out. All right. <laughs> um, I got to explain before my brain gets too far ahead. Okay, so. Two of the three sets of L's is a lie, let's say. So, it, we, there's not possible that only L is a lie in one of the rows, right? So, it, it could be a lie there. Yeah, there's no way that it could be true. And, and so, these could both be true. That's the only way you can have two of the three that are true. In which case, this is the lie. So, the point is, no matter what, one of these two is gonna be true, these two S's. There's no way that both of these S's can be lies. That's the point. That's the point I'm trying to make in a roundabout way that was much more complicated than it needed to be. One of these two S's is a lie, the gray S's, which means there is no S in the word, which means they're both true, which means this is a lie, which means this is true, which means if that is true, this is a lie. The rest of these are true. And if this is a lie, there isn't, okay, there is an L. One of these is, only one of these can be a lie. But we don't know, because it could be that there's a green L at the end, and this is the lie, right? Which would make that one true at that point. This could also be the lie, because it's supposed to be yellow and it's at the beginning of the word or something. And this one is true, because it's the second one. So we still don't know which of the L's is a lie, but we do know there's an L in the word, there's an A in the word, there's an E in the word. Um, L at the end, E-L would be good, since we have the, uh, that would put this, it would be something like this. Um, gavel, I don't know. I mean, there's lots of things it could be, probably. Hmm, actually, what could it be? It could be navel. Ooh, you know what? Lapel would be a good guess. 
But, but, let's think about this. Can there be two L's in the word? I don't think there can. Because the double L and stall, they would both have to be lies if there's two L's in the word. So actually, lapel doesn't work. So I'm back to gavel or navel. Uh, ooh, camel. Bagel. Ooh, now bagel might be good because it also checks for gab. Oh, well, no, actually. Well, so in normal Wordle, I would say gavel's pretty good because it checks for navel and bagel as well. But in this one, we could get a yellow G and we wouldn't know whether to trust it. I'm gonna go with that anyways. Okay. So, so now what do we do? What do we do here now? If, if it's an L at the end, this is the lie. But, right, but if that's the lie, that makes this one true. And how are we gonna have all of these yellow A's be true when, uh, yeah, when the E is true here, yeah, there's no place to put the A, so this cannot be the lie. This has to be true, which means this is a lie. So the L is not at the end. Okay, so it's not one of those options that I was considering. So the L... Hmm... A, yeah, we don't know much, do we? We could do something like Tails, which gives us a few options for... Uh, it's not going to find any new letters, but it'll help us find the lies, I think. So let's go with that. Okay. So... We know this one's true, we know this one's true, unfortunately. It would have been nice to get uh, a lie. So one of these is the lie. If it's, now interesting, if it's the A or the E, then it's the lie in both of them. If it's the L, then the G or the V has to be the lie. And if it's the L that's the lie, then it's gotta be green, because we know there's an L in the word. If the L, if the L was the lie, let's assume the L was the lie for a minute. It'd have to be green. We would have to have something, something, L, E. The A and the E would be true. So the A would have to be at the end and we would have to have a G or a V. Yeah, so I don't think that works. So I think, I think the L is true. So the A or the E is the lie, but we know if the A is the lie, then the E is true. And again, it has to be EA at the end. But, assuming the L is true, that means the A or the E is the lie in both spots, which means the G and the V are true. So, it would have to be something like, <clears throat> like that. If the A is the lie, or if the A is, oh, no, wait, no, no, oh, if the A is the lie, then yeah, 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 it could be like this. With the A, because that could be green. Yeah, it would have to be green. It would have to be green. Yeah, yeah, so at A, uh, so at that point, it would have to be L-A something, E something. If the A is the lie. Um, I mean, it could be laced. Or maybe lacer. Uh, ooh, or layer. Let's try layer. Okay, so, so, one of these two E's is a lie. The green or the yellow, which makes the A true. So the A was not the lie. The A is true. And so I think, now I marked these, uh, let's go back. Is it possible? No, because this means that the green E is the lie, which means that's a lie, which means these are true. So the green E is the lie. All of my assumptions have been wrong so far. So uh, this E is then true, because we know there's an E in the word. We know it can't be there, because those are the lies. So this is true. L, I could, the L could be at the beginning. It could be L, E, A. R, something like that. 
But then, what's the, what's the lie? Oh, the L would be the lie in that case. Yeah, I, d I don't think that works. So if the L is the lie, then I think we're in trouble. Um, what about something E, A, Y? Uh, B, oh, but there's no L. So the L can't be third, fourth, or fifth. So it has to be either, either second or that L is the lie and it's first. So if it is first, then we need to have, I mean, it could be E, A, something like this. No, I think, I think I like the L second, E, A, ooh, it could be clear. What would be the lie on that last one? Yeah, none of, none of them would be lies then. So we need to do plead, plead would work. I don't know, let's try it. Oh, it was plead, there we go, okay. So the R was the lie, all right. Well, we were we were doing pretty good. Um, Oh, it doesn't, interesting, it usually marks the, it marked all the lies with the dotted lines, but it didn't mark the one in the second row. <laughs> Anyways, all right, well, uh, that was a tough one. I've, all of my assumptions ended up being wrong, but we got there in the end, so let me know how you did with today's Fibble. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. What do colors look like to me? Now, it's hard to answer that one really because I don't know any different. I've been colorblind my whole life. Dang. Okay, so and that's where the I R is. Uh, so the C and the H and the Y are no good. So there's gotta be an O. Oh, wondered, wondered. Okay, so we can do, ooh, ooh, we have peaking. It could be speaking actually.